Hey guys, Darkshot the Poisoner here, bringing you some more Let's Play Castlevania Dawn of Sorrow. And apologizing for the abrupt ending of the last episode, but I did something that I didn't want to do, so I actually um, went back and uh, to this warp room. And I am now in the warp room of the Dark Chapel, and I wanted to show you what I was trying to get at um, with uh, the warping equal, uh, where the warp points equal a save point. See, now if we warp to the Garden of Madness over here, it's going to take us uh, very near a save point, which I will go and save at. So, as you can see, I just, I just have to, like, drop down, you know, fight my way past this tree ant. Not that big of a deal. Actually, wow, that is kind of a big deal. I'm gonna die, aren't I? Or not. Come on. Yes, okay. And here we go, we're at the save point. So, you know... It's kind of close, and you can if you can just fight your way through the tree ant, it's pretty much the same as the save point, or the war points that are, that is. There's going to be one that's really, really close um, to a save point um, near the end of the game, and there's one going to be one that's even closer than this one near the middle of the game, so, so it kind of progresses. Anyway, now I'm going to warp back to um, the Lost Village, because I need to pick up some weapons. So I'll see you guys there. Hey, I'm back. So while I was off screen, I, um, I grinded for... Uh, I grinded it for um, two mini devil souls, believe it or not, so I can um, level up my katana and I can keep a mini devil soul for myself because it's actually kind of a useful power. I'll show you what it does in just a little bit. Kotetsu was crafted. That's nice. Oh, now we actually have to get a devil devil to uh, level it up again. I don't think we can do that anymore. Let me see. Let's equip um, our 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 our. our, our what is it? Here we go. No. Yeah, okay. Mini Devil under this one, I guess. Okay, now that we're on our way out. No, actually, this is going to get cut out too. There's a lot of cuts in this episode. Alright, now I'm in the warp point of the Lost Village, and I will warp my way back to the Dark Chapel, along with my new weapon, synthesized with the Mini Devil Soul. Souls! Uh, okay, I guess that's what it looks like, my new weapon. It's kind of golden, is it? I don't know. I don't know, I don't, I'm colorblind. But let's make our way through this extremely laggy room, not get hurt. Bitch out of my way. I don't care about your flower petals. They lag my game even more, so... Move, bitch. Get out the way. Um, there's gonna be another guy coming up. Uh, that we have to soul grind. Not right now, but you can. And he's going to give you the upgrade on the next great sword, which will be greatly helpful. It's this guy! Oh, how fun! Doesn't he just look like a blast to beat? Well, he is. And I'm getting out my tail so that I can do double damage. Double damage! Okay. You want to kick down that light? There we go. Give me a heart. And there's actually another one of them. So. There. They shouldn't be too hard to beat. They do quite a bit of damage when they do their um, winding up giant blade attack. There's only a couple attacks they actually do. I'm going to keep out my tail for quite a while here. And actually, it seems to have a lot of effect on that Valkyrie. And you can also soul grind for a Valkyrie. It is the next step in the synthesis for... Um, oh, wow. 
It's the next step in the synthesis after you use the great armor for the great sword. That's incredible. I'm just gonna skip over this bitch. Cause she is a bitch. Fucking lightning bolts that travel after you. And hey! Guess where we are? Another boss! Another boss. And this is um, a boss that we have to do right now because uh, he's gonna give us a power that will allow us to con uh, continue forward. Jeez, I can talk, man. Bring. Data has been saved. Thank you very much. Alright, I'll meet you guys back at the boss because I need to practice beating him first. See you then. Before we do any of that crap, though, I forgot something that we really need to do. Does anyone remember this room? Where there is a student witch. Yes, you need to soul grind for her power. So I'll meet you back here when I have it. Alright guys, I'm back and with the power that I need to defeat this boss, which surprisingly is the student witch power. I know, it looks ridiculous, and it's probably one of the weakest powers in the game, but it is ex <laughs> it's incredibly useful and hilarious when you use it against this boss, because he gets so weak, and you will see why. <gasps> He's like making noises and then... This guy gets hit, and he's like, whoa! And holy shit, how did he do that? Well, I guess he has sort of the same power that we do, only he doesn't have to absorb souls. He can just learn powers. Oh, excuse me for that rather uncouth scene, yes. You're one of the Dark Lord's candidates. Yeah, no shit, Soma, way to go. Dmitry Blinov. You are fighting a demon. Does that mean you're forsaken? you've forsaken Celia? You have drawn the wrong conclusion that this is merely a ritual to gain power. A ritual? You witnessed it, yes? Unless you are as dim as Dario, you should be able to discern my ability, yes? So that's what it is. The ability to copy magic attacks. Ah, how observant of you. Now, he can copy magic attacks. I don't know if he can co uh, like copy physical attacks. He definitely can't, I guess. I don't know. I don't know. What am I saying? Now, since there is no one else to stop us, hold it. I don't have any reason to fight you. Do you have any reason for going along with Celia's scheme? None whatsoever, yes? Well then. However, I have this power. I wish to know the meaning of its significance. Is that not a natural desire, yes? And for that, you wanted to become the Dark Lord? Is that so wrong? Refining my power will finally provide me with the answers, yes? Let us begin. Now here's where it becomes... Oh, shoot. Uh... If you... Uh, sh pff, 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 what the f, man? Oh, what the, f what the fuck? Okay, immediately use your cat power because then he'll be like, "Oh, I learned that power." He only knows one power at a time. But look, he just throws cats. He goes through the whole entire battle just using cats. It's so incredibly easy if you do it this way. And I'm actually gonna potion myself up. And if you just throw a couple cats back and hit him a couple, oh shoot, you hit him a couple times. He he's so ridiculously easy. I can't even express it. This is probably going to be the most boring boss battle you ever see, because all, all it's going to be is us throwing cats back and forth, and him not really even hitting me, except for the beginning there. That was just bullshit. Oh shoot! Oh, he hit me. I lied. I I got hit. Oh, oh, I feel so stupid now. What you should do is you should get out your katana, attack him, and then dodge backward. Don't go for the second hit, because he um, sometimes come ba uh, comes back with one of the cats right in your face, which is what I accidentally did there. See, he comes back with another cat. And when he's just walking around, make sure you use a cat, especially when he dodges backward. He'll be like, ha 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 ha, and then he'll dodge backward. Or he'll, like, crumple in pain. He'll be like, Ugh! See, when he does that, just throw a cat at him. Uh -huh, ha 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 What the fuck? I didn't see that cat, I'm sorry. Okay, so two times I've gotten hit twice in this battle. The beginning doesn't count still, because that's just bullshit. No, jump. Don't press up, jump. Yeah, look at him, he's just throwing cats all over the place. Holy cats, man! And there we go, that's the end! Ridiculous! It's over! I came up short. I came up short. It seems. I won't take your life. Just give up. You dare pity me? Look in my eyes. Look in my eyes. Soon you shall be the one who will be pitied upon. 
and he goes, <laughs> and then he crumples. What? Dad, that can't be. And he didn't kill him. And suddenly this dark soul appears from him. <laughs> what was that? Did I gain dominance over a human soul? No, I gained no power. But what was that light? Yeah, so we gained dominance over a human soul. What's up with that? Now, I'm actually going to go back and save because I think coming up there's another boss fight. I'm not quite sure. Crossing my fingers that I'm not right when I say that. So I'm going to go save.